hi guys welcome to my youtube channel in this video i am going to show you how to create a beautiful photography website for displaying your entire photo album after downloading then open your website and then go to theme panel then go to appearances and themes and then click on add new theme after that click on upload theme then choose the file which you have downloaded previously from the link okay now open this black silver which you see on the screen now click on install now okay it is loading we need to wait some time until it until it installs so let's wait after installing the theme then simply click on activate which is in the center and that's all and the theme is activated up till now then next the thing you need to do is next go to install plugins and in the checkbox click on the checkbox all the plugins should be selected and then click bulk actions and then click on install and then click on apply as you can see uh, the plugins are installing so let's wait until the plugins get in gets installed all the plugins are installed now click on return to required plugins installer and then now click on again click on checkbox and bulk actions and then click on activate now and then click on apply all the plugins have been installed reload the web reload the website once by clicking the reload button as we can see here now the demo files are imported but some of the files in the demo has failed has failed to import okay as they are not much necessary we, sh we will ignore them and now go go back to website and then click on reload you can see here now the demo has been imported successfully there are many home pages let's visit and choose the best home page for our photography website good so you can you can also keep it in a slider way this is a slider you can scroll it through okay let's take another home page home page is to this is same as the first one now go to home pages 3 this is little good and far better from all others let's go to film home pages 4 from only four home pages we can see that only home page 3 is good home page 3 name is fatorama phil now we can see many extra pages here in the pages you can see about me services services 2 services 3 they are all different different pages with different different layouts we can choose the best one among them okay and we will remove all this extra, all this about me we, we have selected and then click on our services and refer four websites and then select only one then gallery gallery box then gallery box column 3 see you can select anything from here it's not mandatory to to select only the one which i have selected these are the events event galleries this is a shop okay now let's modify and remove unnecessary pages from this categories okay <coughs> now then simply go to settings sorry uh first we need to change our home page so let's go to settings and then click on reading and then click on a static page and under the home page categories then select the home page 
select the name okay guys I want to set two books to gallery as my home page so select I will select here gallery box to column and now I'll click on save changes okay when I open my website home page see when I open my website home page when I scroll down I can see here gallery of my latest photos this is and this is a demo content this is, these are demo photos these are not mine see we can open and we can scroll through scroll also many photos okay and then now let's remove all this and uh, let's remove all these unnecessary categories from here now go to appearances and click on menus instead of removing all this it is better to create a menu and up and we need to replace this menu with the, with the new created one click on create new menu here name something I will name it as globos underscore main then click on and then click on create menu see just have a look the menu is being created and now we need to choose what pages we want to add this to add the add to our menu sorry then click on I want to add about me see it is here I want to I want to add this page then keep a tick mark in the checkbox and now glow I want to add block grid and then go down and I want to add one contact us page mm, I want to add gallery box to column next and then click on add to menu okay only page two elements are added let's go let's go back again to page one and select our required items about me blog grid to column gallery box to column and then click on add to menu okay and as gallery is my home page I will t I will drag and drop at the first place and I will rename 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 it as home and then about me and then I will rename it as blog and our services and I will rename it as portfolio and that's all and arrange the order which you want to place in And that's all guys and then click on save menu sorry and then click on main menu and tick on and also tick on mobile menu and then click on save menu now again go back to website and just simply reload the website as you can see everything else has changed home this is my home next portfolio this is my portfolio collection then blog the recent post which we have which we have uploaded previously will show here then next our services our services will be shown here next about me and that's all so what is the next step we need to modify we need to remove all this gallery collection and we need to remove change the logo we need to do, do some changes to look better okay 
now i'll touch edit the home page i will click on edit page and let's wait back to wordpress editor and now open website once we need to confirm which we want to edit and I want to remove this completely and I will simply select this and I will click on delete section and that's all everything is removed and then click on update I go back to website and then click on reload see everything has changed and only photos are appearing sorry and photos and only photos are appearing and the thing which is left over is we need to change the logo to change the logo click on customize here and then go to logos and go to main logo then select on remove then click select file and then click select files and upload the logo which you want to place at the main menu and then click on upload I'm just showing this for demo purpose after that click publish things will be changed and now if you want to mention your credits in a footer then go to footer and then change here then click on publish the and it has been published now go back the photo logo will all will be changed immediately don't worry about that the logos photo logo change here also change everything when you upload when you want to upload a new logo so sidebar is for blog post okay and that's all a website has been published let's check it again this is our photo gallery in this i will show you by changing the home page again as this is not a great look go back to settings and then click on reading and now click on gallery box column 3 click on save changes this is quite better than the previous one so again we need to remove this portion then simply click on edit with elementor and now simply click on the run button and click on update see everything is okay and our photography wordpress website is ready and you can upload and i will show you how to upload this post and where to upload this post now again go back to Mm. go back to portfolios and then upload the image here when uploading choose the characters here I mean choose the categories here and then click on publish and if you want to upload the blog post then click on add new blog post and enter the heading here and enter the paragraphs below 
then click on publish now go to blog and you can see a recent post here and also if you want to change the sidebar of this blog this recent post recent comments now again go back to appearances widgets and now you can see here search search and then click on rem delete and the send post and then click on delete remove the unnecessary items and if you want to add any new items then simply select from the left side and simply drag here and then the changes will remain automatically don't worry about that click on reload once block see the changes have been made changed and if you want to change this about me then again click on edit with elementor and click on edit at right here And you can see here content my story and type the text which you want to print on the home page this is the text and if you want to change this image and click on edit and you can choose the image here as you can see the image has been uploaded it and in a similar way you can have edit each and everything using Elementor then click on update go back to home page and then click on about me see the changes have been made changed in the similar way you can uh, you can edit each and everything Okay guys, and that's all. Our website is ready. Let's reload it and check it again. This is the website and your recent post or recent photos will appear here. And your portfolio will appear in the under portfolio section. These are the portfolios. Then click on blog to check to check your recent post. Then our services if you want you can remove this entire thing and if and you can make it based on your requirement also this is about me and i hope everything is done and uh, and finally our photography website is ready with our latest clicks and blog portfolio of our services we can add resume here and you can add anything based on your choice and finally our website is ready okay guys and there is one thing left over to say we are offering we are designing a wordpress website at very low price including hosting we charge rupees 1200 for wordpress website plus hosting for one year Hosting for one year plus WordPress website, we charge only 1200. One else provides WordPress website plus hosting at 1200. If you want, then you can contact me at this Instagram page or anything else which is posted on this video or, or which is under the description. Okay, guys, and thank you for watching the video. Please subscribe and like for, to get regular.